Hello, dear artificial intelligence enthusiasts. Today, we're about to unpack some of the biggest news in AI this year. Rumors, leaks, and shocking updates are swirling around OpenAI's potential next big release. Its new model, rumored to be called GPT-5 or codenamed Orion. This isn't just a typical product announcement. It sparked reactions from none other than OpenAI's CEO, Sam Altman. The hype is huge, but why is this announcement such a big deal? And what could it mean for the future of artificial intelligence? Let's break down everything we know and everything we still have questions about together. All right, so here's the scoop. Over the last few hours, social media has gone into overdrive. A major article from The Verge dropped, claiming that OpenAI has a major new model in the works and that it might be ready by December. But here's the twist. It may not be immediately available to the general public. According to the report, OpenAI might offer first access to certain companies, allowing them to integrate Orion into their own products and services. Why would OpenAI take this approach? It's a savvy move if you think about it. By working closely with key partners first, they can gather real-world feedback, iron out any issues, and refine the model to ensure it's safe and reliable before releasing it to the rest of us. It's a cautious yet ambitious step forward, and it could be a way for OpenAI to demonstrate Orion's capabilities through real-world applications across industries. But what's so special about Orion anyway? Industry insiders are saying it could be up to 100 times more powerful than GPT-4. Think about that. A model that could not only generate responses, but understand, analyze, and even anticipate needs with an accuracy we haven't seen before. Imagine AI that goes beyond text generation to act almost like an advisor or problem solver across countless fields. The potential applications are staggering, but what does 100 times more powerful actually mean? Are we talking about a model that processes information faster, that interprets context more deeply, or that performs complex multi-step operations almost effortlessly? Or could it even be a combination of all these improvements? The potential here is both thrilling and honestly a little bit intimidating. If Orion really lives up to these claims, we could be on the verge of a major leap toward artificial general intelligence or AGI, something that could reshape industries, economies, and even society as a whole. Let's talk about where this leak came from. The Verge article that broke the story isn't known for deep AI scoops, but it's caused enough of a stir that people are starting to take notice. And this isn't the first hint we've had about Orion. Over the past few months, Sam Altman and others at OpenAI have dropped subtle clues about a groundbreaking project in development. Now, insider sources at Microsoft, OpenAI's key partner, have reportedly begun prepping Azure data centers to host Orion, possibly as soon as next month. That's right, we could be just weeks away from seeing this technology deployed, and this isn't just any upgrade. Orion is rumored to represent a new approach to AI modeling, possibly including a revolutionary new architecture designed specifically for complex reasoning and problem solving. What's fueling Orion's potential? According to some reports, OpenAI has been using a training technique codenamed Strawberry to make Orion exceptionally accurate. Now, this Strawberry method isn't about cramming more data into the model. It's about generating higher quality data that's precisely tuned to reduce errors and hallucinations in the model's responses. Picture this, if traditional AI models are like giant libraries where every book is important, Strawberry would be like carefully curating the collection to include only the highest quality, most relevant information. The result, a model that's not only vast, but also far more accurate and trustworthy than previous iterations. So instead of overwhelming Orion with endless data, OpenAI is refining it with the best data, turning it into a model that could understand, interpret, and respond with a new level of sophistication. Of course, with every big claim comes a little skepticism. Can Orion really be 100 times more powerful than GPT-4? We've heard claims of revolutionary advancements before, and while each new model has certainly pushed the envelope, we haven't seen jumps of this magnitude. Even Sam Altman himself has hinted that future improvements will be gradual, each version smarter and more capable than the last, but not necessarily in quantum leaps. But then again, OpenAI has surprised us before. Remember the incredible jump in capabilities from GPT-3 to GPT-4, especially with GPT-4's multimodal abilities. If Orion can build on that foundation, it might not just improve on GPT-4, it could redefine the AI landscape entirely. Let's take a moment to consider what this could mean for everyday users like us. Think of Orion as not just a tool, but a partner in creativity, problem solving, and discovery. This model could handle tasks that usually require significant human effort, like drafting complex reports, providing nuanced customer service, or even assisting in creative projects. Imagine using Orion as your brainstorming partner for a big project, or 
as an assistant that helps you navigate complex workflows effortlessly. This is the kind of AI that doesn't just react to commands. It could become an integral part of how we work, create, and think. And with advancements in reasoning and contextual understanding, Orion might excel in fields where AI has struggled before, like law, medicine, finance, and education. But here's the thing. OpenAI isn't the only player in this game. Competitors like Google and Anthropic are pushing hard to claim the top spot in AI innovation. Google's Gemini project, for example, is expected to be a significant leap forward as well. And with such intense competition, OpenAI's cautious rollout strategy for Orion suggests a commitment to responsibility. By offering early access to select companies, they're likely gathering crucial insights and ensuring Orion's stability and safety before a broader release. It's clear they're taking the responsibility of releasing such a powerful model very seriously especially when the stakes are this high. After all, with great power comes the need for even greater caution. What if Orion lives up to its potential? Imagine the productivity boost across industries, with companies and professionals leveraging Orion's capabilities to automate complex tasks, predict trends, and solve problems in real time. It could fundamentally change how we think about work and creativity. And with Orion's rumored enhancements, we might see AI transforming areas we never expected, from personalized healthcare recommendations to instant legal insights, from real-time financial predictions to breakthroughs in scientific research. This isn't just AI advancing, it's AI evolving into something profoundly impactful. Let's face it, with each new generation of AI, we're getting closer to a future that feels both thrilling and uncertain. But OpenAI's careful approach to Orion hints at a dedication to doing this the right way. Sam Altman has been vocal about the need for responsibility in AI, especially as models become more powerful and influential. It's a reminder that while the future holds massive potential, it also comes with the need for ethical, safe, and thoughtful development. This is about creating technology that truly benefits humanity while minimizing risks. So what do you think? Is Orion the dawn of a new era in AI or simply another step forward in a longer journey? Join the conversation below. Your thoughts might just spark new ideas or even challenge the conventional thinking on what AI can become. And if you want to stay updated on all things AI and tech, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the notification bell to be the first to hear about the latest breakthroughs. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time, stay real.